been a really long time and I apologize that. Uh, long story short, I what, didn't have enough money to buy any food. I got sick. I was busy with school and work and then I just wasn't motivated to cook. But here I am! I'm back! So I haven't really been motivated to cook at all. And then I went to Costco and I was not even expecting to find anything because I don't normally buy meat there. And they had lamb loin chops for really, really cute. They, there's like 10 of them and it was $24, which seems unheard of to me. These chops are pretty um, thick. You could probably cook them like a good, if you wanted to cook them over, like all the way through, you know, just a couple minutes by each side, but we're not going to do that. It has to be really high heat, and I don't think it's hot yet, but um, I don't want to cook it all the way through because we're going to braise it in the oven, and it's going to be exposed to even more heat, so um, I don't want to overcook it, and I don't want it to be dry, and I don't want to be like, why did I pay all this money for this? And it's not even ready yet. I think I'm gonna do a minute on each side. I wanna say that's safe. It's probably not a horrible idea. And I want to make sure these guys have space. Okay, it's been about a minute. So I'm gonna flip them over. Ooh, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna bet a minute on both sides. Ooh, it's smoking now. I'm gonna take them off and they're gonna cool for a little bit. Obviously, they're not, obviously, I know. They're not fully cooked. And that's that's fine. We don't eat it. Because they're gonna cook more later. So that's gonna cool down. I'm gonna show off some of my wine. And I splurged a lot. I bought this $10 wine. Oh my god. And it's fancy, it's from Spain, and there's this label thing on the back. It's kind of cool. And I can't wait to drink it. I mean, use it for the wine sauce. Okay. Nice and tucked in with the wine that I hope you can see. I'll let those puppies sit in the fridge overnight. I'm gonna start it up tomorrow. been a whole day in my like, cast iron skillet I have um, onion crushed garlic and thyme and we're gonna put our lamb chops in there nice and fermented <laughs> Oh man, it smells like wine so much. I have some rosemary I forgot to mention earlier. Okay, I'm gonna cover with foil. So this stuff's really easy. You just wait. Uh, so the oven is preheated to 250 and. I'm putting it at two hours and I'm gonna check and see how it's going from there. The recipe that I'm roughly following is saying three hours, but they used a lamp shank and I'm not. So I think it's gonna be less, but we'll find out in two hours. So it's been two hours and they are definitely ready. I wish you could smell it. it smells so good. Braised lamb chops. And now you have
have a dish that you can easily impress anybody that you want. For more detailed instructions on how to recreate this dish, I am attaching the recipe I loosely follow in the description box. Thank you for watching and I hope you try this dish at home. See you next time.